Hello everybody, it's Vertical Sandwich! Welcome to Let's Play Portal. Uh, this is the PS3 version of Portal. So, uh, let's just get started. I have played through this game completely already. Hello, and again, welcome to the Aperture Science Computer Aided Enrichment Center. We hope your brief detention in the relaxation vault has been a pleasant one. Your specimen has been processed, and we are now ready to begin the test proper. Before we start, however, keep in mind that although fun and learning are the primary goals of all enrichment center activities, serious injuries may occur for your own safety and the safety of others. Please refrain from... Turn back. The portal will open in three, two, one. Alright, there we are. Okay, so I'm gonna go over. First off, X is jump. Circle is crouch. X is jump. Circle is crouch. And square is pick up things. Like this radio. Portal is essentially a first-person shooter cover pu puzzle game. Hey, fantastic! <laughs> I didn't know it did that. All right, uh, out we go through the portal. All right, now I'm gonna run you through solutions to things and stuff like that. Uh, also, hey, look, cake. Um, and I will also run you through some shortcuts and some glitches and things, because I can. So let's look around and see what's going on. Alright. All right, pretty obvious what we have to do here. Excellent. Please proceed into the chamber lock after completing each test. First, however, note the incandescent particle field across the exit. This aperture science material events a patient grid will vaporize any unauthorized equipment that passes through it. For instance, the aperture science weighted storage cube. I will show that off uh, uh, at a later date. So there we go, Aperture Laboratories. One of nineteen. Important. Please place the weighted storage cube on the fifteen hundred megawatt aperture science heavy duty super colliding super button. Oh, cool, I got it. Perfect. Please move quickly to the chamber lock, as the effects of prolonged exposure to the button are not part of this test. Okay, let's, uh, if you haven't noticed, it's go in the blue portal, come out the, uh, the orange portal, and vice versa. 
So here's where the cube was. Somewhere I thought we could see the gun shooting these portals. But I might be wrong. We may see that later. But it's clearly making, uh, it, it's moving one portal around through a series of rooms. So the next one will be the button. There's the button. And then the next one after that will be the door. Very strange. But these are tutorial levels, so... I have a habit of shooting this door, so... Which you can't do right now. And the elevator will often be a loading screen. So we should be prepared for that. You're doing very well. Please be advised that a noticeable taste of blood is not part of any test protocol, but is an unintended side effect of the Aperture Science Material Emancipation Grip, which may, in semi-rare cases, emancipate dental filling, crowns, tooth enamel, and teeth. That is a terrifying warning. Alright, where is this taking us? Wait, do I want to go here? I do! Come here, you! Very good. You are now in possession of the Aperture Science handheld portal device. With it, you can create your own portals. These intradimensional gates have proven to be completely safe. The device, however, has not. Do not touch the operational end of the device. Do not look directly at the operational end of the device. Do not submerge the device in liquid, even partially. Most importantly, under no circumstances should you... So, uh, n we cannot move the orange portal, but now we can move the blue portal anywhere we want to move it. Which can include places like the ceiling. And only one portal at a time. So, out we go. Please proceed to the chamber lock. Mind the gap. Now, one of the things we can do... To ensure the safe performance of all authorized activities, do not destroy vital testing apparatus. Alright! Oh, that stuff all came out over there. A minute. Oh, well, it was that point. Am I missing something? Oh, wait, it's right next to me. I know, I just solved the stupid puzzle. Well, what am I thinking? remember, the Aperture Science Bring Your Daughter to Work Day is the perfect time to have her tested. So there we go, we got like three rooms down in like ten minutes. That's fantastic. Some of these rooms are going to be harder than others, and like I said, some have shortcuts, so most have shortcuts. I'm just not worried about shortcuts. So, uh, I think when we come back, uh, more of this.
Bye, everybody.